Hello Libra, this is Renee and welcome back. Libra, this is going to be your March reading for March 2023. What's coming towards you, what you can expect from March 1st through the 15th. Let's get some energy. Okay, we have perseverance. I know that I can do whatever I see my mind to. Whatever I set my mind to. Sorry, I don't have my glasses on. Okay, whatever I set my mind to. Okay. And worry. I am learning that worry doesn't change an outcome. So, Libra, we also have forgiveness. I acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love. So, the, and Libra, I, I feel like you're trying to push through some kind of emotion, some kind of worry that you're feeling and uh, you may have a need of forgiveness sometime um, in March there may be a need to you for you to forgive somebody okay we have a jumper already of course so we have the five of cups so I feel like Libra there may be something that you are releasing something that you will be leaving behind you we have the four of pentacles and we have the hangman so i feel like you're trying to get a better perspective maybe you're trying to get a better perspective of something that you desire to do something that you desire i feel like after leaving something behind i feel like you have a desire for something different something new and i feel like you have the have the need to surround yourself around people who may be building something um you may be looking for a perspective to progress some type of idea some type of some kind of ability that you have you may be collaborating to focus on a certain skill Libra we have the magician so I feel like there's something that you're you're trying to create. There's something that you're trying to bring forward. Um, the Seven of Wands. Okay. And the Strength card. And we have the, the Three of Swords. Okay. <clears throat> At the bottom we have the Four of Cups. Okay, Lib Libra, so here's the deal. I feel like, you know, there's something that you're leaving behind, but you desire so much more. I feel like you're trying to gain another perspective. You may be surrounding yourself around people who have a certain skill so that you can kind of create this skill within yourself, okay? Um, but I feel like you're kind of not giving up. Um... I feel like you're working very hard to create whatever this is in your mind uh, because with the strength card um, I feel like you're you're focused you're able um, but you may not have all the information that you need to bring this together okay and I feel like that there's a lot of doubt there's like something blocking you something blocking you from bringing forward these ideas or this creation that you're working on um, I feel like you have a lot of worry at the moment but you feel like you need to 
pursue something that's going to make you more happy. Um, and I feel like because of this kind of perseverance to find happiness, I feel like you have a need to forgive something or forgive forgive yourself maybe um, is what I'm getting. Let's see, let's get a little bit more information for Libra. Okay. We have, with the Five of Cups, we have the the Six of Wands. So I really feel like, you know, there's, there's something that you're leaving behind. But I feel like that's like pushing you forward into creating something different. Something totally different than what you have left behind. Whether this is in love or in business or in some kind of project that you're doing. I feel like your focus is finding something totally different, something that is going to um, possibly bring you more happiness and bring you more stability. I feel like the things that you're desiring, you're trying very hard to move towards. You, you're working on you know, finding the right path to go on. I, you know, Libra, when I'm looking at these cards, I'm feeling a little bit confused because there's a lot of information, but very little detail. Okay? So I feel like all of the information that you have is not enough information. And I, I feel like you're, you're looking to find answers for more information on what this is that you want. If this is a love issue, I feel like you're kind of confused about the issue because you're not necessarily clear on what it is you truly want out of this love relationship. Okay. Um, with the hangman energy, we have the magician. We have the magician twice in this. So I feel like you're definitely trying to create something that you may be dreaming about. Or you may have a vision um, to create, but and I feel like you're you're like trying to manifest this energy, and there there's something blocking you. There's something kind of blocking this creative energy that you're having. Um, it's it's very interesting that we have the magician twice. So I feel like. You're, you're really pursuing something. You're pursuing some type of skill, some kind of creation, some kind of thought or desire that you have in your mind. And you're trying to kind of decide how this should go. Uh, with the, the Three of Pentacles, we have the Emperor. So I feel like what, what you may be lacking at the moment is control. And I feel like you're trying to pursue the opportunity or the skill to gain more control in your life. Um, very interesting and confusing all at once. Okay. Um, with the Magician card, we have the Four of Swords. So I feel like whatever this is that you're trying to create, you have all of the ability within yourself. Um, you just need to... Focus your abilities. You need to focus what this is you want. And really take time out to set your intention on exactly what that is. Because with this Four of Swords energy, I'm really feeling like um, there's something that you want to renew. But you need to gain your solitude in order to focus. So I feel like you're trying to um, kind of do this within your inner self. Okay. With the Seven of Wands, we have the Five of Pentacles. No. We have the. Oh, my goodness. Just one moment.
Okay, with the Seven of Wands, we have the Three of Pentacles. So we have the Three of Pentacles twice. So I feel like you're really trying to surround yourself with people who have um, more knowledge, more authority, more, you know, um, desire to gain what this is that you're looking to pursue. I feel like you're, you're like collaborating. You may be teaming up with someone. Okay, with the Strength card... We have the uh, Six of Pentacles. So with the Strength and the Six of Pentacles, I feel like what, what, what you're really looking for is some kind of balance, some kind of feeling of belonging. Um, I'm really feeling like you want to belong to something. Maybe you want to belong to someone. Okay. Yeah, because we have the the hangman and the lovers on this three of swords. So I feel like you're you're like getting this different perspective, but I feel like you're in search of love. You're in search of someone who's going to kind of look at you in that way that they're like seeing you for who you are. Okay? So if you are open to love, I feel like there is love here, but in, uh, this love is a little confusing. It's not very clear how um, or what this love is turning into. Okay. Okay, we have the, the Three of Cups. So I feel like you're dead. There's definitely a lot of people in this reading. You are surrounding yourself by a social group. You are um, maybe really getting out there and socializing, surrounding yourself with people um, after being kind of solitary for a while. So and I feel like you, you're finally getting out of the house and trying to enjoy yourself, trying to find what it is that you desire. Okay, um, so very interesting energy. Uh, let's get an outcome. Whatever this is, Libra, I feel like there's something that you're leaving behind. It could be some kind of emotions, some kind of deep emotions that you're harboring deep within. But I feel like something is being released. Something is... There's something that you're you're putting a lot of time into, a lot of work into. I feel like you really want some kind of outcome, something to what you're building. Very interesting and, and confusing at the same time. This reading is like really all over the place. I'm not quite sure what exactly the true desire that's being built here. But I do see that, you know, there's the Five of Swords twice, the Three of Pentacles twice. The magician twice. There, there's something that's being created, but there's something that's also being left behind. Okay, we have the six of swords energy. So I feel like you're trying to move into a different... Um, more calm space. But I feel like you're you're kind of you're not clear which way you're going. There's a lot of confusing issues with this reading, Libra. I feel like your mind is all over the place. I feel like with this two of pentacles energy, you're not you're having a very hard time focusing. 
and setting your priorities. There, there's some kind of choices that you need to make, but I feel like you kind of don't know where to start. You don't know how to move forward in this direction. Maybe it's because you're still feeling the feelings of having to leave something behind. You, you're still feeling kind of grief and worry from uh, having to release something or something being released. Um, maybe you're not the one who initiated that. But I feel like you're having a hard time moving forward. We have the Eight of Cups at the bottom, so it's definitely something that you're moving past. But I feel like you're still deep in thought. You're still working on your emotions, Libra. I feel like you're trying to get those emotions right in your mind, but you're just not, you're not able to focus. Hmm. Let's get some oracle cards. Maybe that'll make things more clear. Because things are really jumbled in this reading, Libra. It's just all over the place. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, we have downloads and understanding. Truth is being revealed. Deep thoughts are coming from heaven and the astral realm. So you may be getting some kind of downloads, some kind of visions. Maybe that's the reason why your emotions are like all over the place. I feel like there's there's focus, but there's no real destination on where that focus is, is you know, being led to. Very, very interesting energy, this reading. Um, Libra, let's get some more messages for Libra. More messages for Libra, please. We have abundance. So I feel like you may be trying to create your abundance. You may be you may be so caught up in work that you know you're just not able to focus on anything other than trying to gain your control with whatever this is that you're manifesting. Um hmm. Maybe that's the reason why you're so closed off. We also have impatience. So there may be a need for you to be a little bit more patient with yourself as well as with your with your situation. Um, and we have insecurity. So there may be some insecurities that you need to kind of focus on so that you're able to put those insecurities behind you and move forward. Um, because I feel like there is something that's being left behind, but I'm not quite sure if that's your insecurities. I feel like what you're leaving behind is something that you desire to do, and you're not really focused on getting it done. It's something that you may have maybe dreamt of doing or envisioned yourself doing. But you feel like you don't have the time, you don't have, you don't have the money, the means, or the capability at the moment. But with this, with this Emperor card, I feel like you have control of whatever you feel like you have control in. Okay, Libra? Um, I feel like the focus is just really off in this reading. Like, almost like being under the influence and not really being able to focus due to being intoxicated you know that that's kind of what I'm feeling like I'm feeling like the the 
the reading is just all over the place. Okay, we have a prosperity lies ahead, new moon in Taurus. So there is pros uh, prosperity for you, Libra. I, I just feel like you need to focus on what this is you want. A win-win outcome is in the forecast. So I feel like whatever this is that you want, Libra, you have the ability to do it. I just feel like, you know, you need to be able to gain your clarity and, you know, gain your focus. Because I feel like your focus is really, really off. Okay, we have signs and reminders. So, Libra, you may be seeing certain signs. Um, you may be seeing certain synchronicities, certain things. You know, like I said, we, we have cards in here that are like showing up twice, like the Magician, the Three of Pentacles, um, the, uh, the Five of Cups. So I feel like maybe fives, threes um, are very important to you. The magician, the magician is number two. Yeah, the magician is number, no, the magician is number one. So um, I feel like numbers, maybe one, one, five, five, three, three. Maybe maybe those are the dates for birthdays or the day that you were born. Something like that. But I feel like those numbers are very significant. I feel like they have some sort of meaning. And I feel like you're getting some kind of signs. You're getting some kind of downloads. Maybe that's the reason why things are so jumbled at the moment. Because maybe you're trying to process what it is that you're downloading. Because um, and I just feel a lot of confusion. A lot of lack of understanding with this reading. It's so all over the place. Hmm. To tell the truth, I'm not even sure if I'm going to upload this reading because it's just so all over. I'm like having a hard time understanding where it's going myself. Okay, and we have a manifestation. I feel like you're definitely manifesting, Libra, but I'm not quite sure what this is that you're manifesting. Um, it could be a couple different things. It could be many things that you're trying to manifest to bring forward. Um, one of those being love. But I, I feel like there's a lot of confusion. There's a lot of trying to find a clear meaning in this situation. Okay? And we have do the work. So the, there's some kind of work that you still need to do. Some kind of work that still needs to be done. Uh, Libra. Let's get some manifestation cards. Okay. We have honor your feelings. So take time to take time out for yourself, Libra. Honor your feelings. Honor when you're feeling too tired. Honor when you're feeling that confusion so that you can regain your balance, regain some kind of understanding. Okay, uh, we have release control. So there may be something that you need to surrender, some kind of ability, some kind of thought process that you may need to kind of really surrender to the situation so that you can gain a better understanding. And at the bottom, we have New Moon and Leo. Just shine, Libra. Beautiful Libra spirit, just shine. Okay? Okay, that is what I have for you, Libra. And I hope <laughs> this reading helps. But like I said, it's all over the place. So I do apologize, but this is what was in the cards. So, um, Libra, if this resonates Please like and subscribe.
hit the bell so that you don't miss any uploads. Take a look at your sun, moon, and rising to give you more clarification because I'm not sure how clarifying this reading is going to be truly, honestly, okay? Um, until your next reading, Libra, many blessings to you. Love and light.